And so, but then when I look at the way they did it, I was like, wait, the universe is not a two-dimensional surface. There is no such thing. Like, it's remarkable. Physicists make models in their heads and then use them in mathematics and then assume that because they made it in their head and it works in their mathematics that that actually exists out there. Right? So like there is no such thing as a two-dimensional surface. That is, there is no <coughs> surface that has no thickness. I mean, it might have a plumb thickness, but it's still thickness, right? It doesn't, the concept of two dimension is a concept of man, not a concept of universe. You know, we say, oh, look, this is a two dimensional happy face, right? No. The ink has dimensions. The board has dimension. The only two dimensional in there is in your brain, right? It doesn't, so the universe is not a holographic projection from a two-dimensional surface into a three-dimensional world. And the universe is not multi-dimensional, like 11-string dimension insanity. It just isn't. <laughs> right? It's really straightforward. It's zero dimension. It's all dimension. Whatever you want to call it. But dimension is a concept of man in mathematics where we put Cartesian planes to try to calculate things. That doesn't mean the universe does that. Uh -huh. The universe does not do that. So what happens...